The chairman of the Republican National Committee, Reince Priebus, is out spreading misinformation and lies again, this time about how much money is being spent by both sides in Wisconsin's recall election in Wisconsin. Reince Priebus was on Andrea Mitchell Reports and said this. Though Walker has promised to take on outside, quote, special interests, he has raised seven and a half times more money than his Democratic opponent. And two thirds of that money, over $30 million, has come from outside Wisconsin, according to the Center for Public Integrity. Joining me now is Reince Priebus, chairman of the Republican National Committee. And most importantly in this context, you are the former chairman of the Republican Party in Wisconsin. You know it well. This is your state. So let's talk about all this money. Uh, the, you, you guys are just clobbering the Democrats sure. with this effort well, to defend Scott Walker. Well, first of all, you know, who knows in the end who spent more? I think there's a lot of union money being spent up there, and, and, and it's enormous effort. Reince Priebus is wrong. Unions are not spending as much as pro-Walker forces are. Scott Walker has received over $20 million from very wealthy individuals outside the state of Wisconsin representing corporate interests. And pro-Walker outside groups such as Americans for Prosperity, Republican Governors Association and others have spent $17 million for a total of $48 million on Scott Walker's side. On the other side, unions have spent $15 million supporting Barrett, hardly the same amount. Reince Priebus either needs to take a math class again or quit spreading lies and misinformation. You know, this would have never had to happen, Andrea, if the unions from the outside wouldn't have come in and tried to hijack the, the state of Wisconsin. And so this is a total lie. When Scott Walker attacked public unions consisting of teachers and firefighters, the groundswell of opposition came from true grassroots efforts inside Wisconsin from Wisconsin citizens that rose up and started the recall effort. One of the first unions who helped start the recall effort against Governor Scott Walker was Council 24 of the AFL-CIO Wisconsin State Employees Union, not outside the state. Reince Priebus, you need to stop spreading lies and misinformation to American voters and quit attacking hardworking Americans with your union busting.